And when it is this hot outside in South Texas, many people flock to the lakes and the rivers trying to cool off. Unfortunately, some of the most popular spots are dealing with low water levels this year because of the lack of rain. That's right. Meteorologist Justin Horn was at Guadalupe River this morning where things are looking really too dry, more dry than normal this time of the year. We're here along the Guadalupe River. In fact, I'm standing in the middle of the Guadalupe River and you can see there is a little water here, but not a lot. And there's not a lot of flow. And that's part of the problem. We're here in Kamau County near Spring Branch where the flow is close to zero. Some areas of stagnant water and th there is some water here. There's still water in this river. You can still come out and swim and enjoy it. But the drought conditions really are starting to take a toll. We're noticing that there is still some flow upstream in places like Kerrville and Comfort. But as you get closer to Spring Branch and closer to Canyon Lake, that flow really starts to fall off. Now on the other side of Canyon Lake, because of the releases, there is still pretty good flow around New Braunfels. So if you have plans to tube uh, in New Braunfels, Guadalupe or Kamau River, it looks fine. The flow is just going to be a little bit slow. The drought, again, is really starting to take a toll on our area, rivers and streams, and it looks like things could get a little bit worse before it gets better. Reporting in Comal County, Justin Horn, KSAT 12 News.